Well, even though it feels like the middle of summer, kids are heading back to school. And this morning, there are some concerns over what it will take to get them there. Yeah, transportation and safety leaders are talking about the impact a school bus driver shortage could have on kids and their parents. Keith McGilvery is with the Fox 6 in School Squad in New Britain this morning. Mm -hmm. And Keith, I mean, as parents are getting ready to send their kids back to, back to school, this is one more problem they got to deal with. Yeah. Yeah, so I guess the bottom line from these folks is they're encouraging patience, they're encouraging kindness. We are at the Datco bus yard here in New Britain to give you some kind of context about this shortage because we've heard about bus driver shortages before. Typically, Datco has about 1,200 drivers across the state. They're just one of many companies that provide service across Connecticut. Typically about 1,200 drivers. Last year, they were about 50 drivers short. This year, there are about 70 to 80 drivers short. The folks who run this bus yard say there are a number of contributing factors here. One of the big ones is the fact that a lot of their drivers are older individuals who just finally decided, given the conditions in this pandemic, they're ready to step away from the profession, at least for right now. So what does that mean for you at home, for parents and kids? New at 8 o'clock, we are hearing from AAA, who is... Getting into this conversation, urging caution, reminding folks to be calm, to stay patient, and to go easy on the road. Take a listen. There are a lot of moving parts this year in terms of back to school safety, not the least of which is the school bus driver shortage, which is going to change potentially uh, bus routes. It's going to make some of them longer. The school buses may be on the road for longer periods of time. You know, this after parents are maybe a little bit out of practice in terms of the whole back to school driving and back to school safety um, situation. Datco echoing much of that uh, message there as well, saying do not be surprised if your kids are getting on the bus earlier in the morning and getting off later in the afternoon. If you think driving a school bus might be good for you, pay range is here from between 18 and $25 an hour with different signing bonuses as well to consider. Want to point out coming up new in our nine o'clock hour, we're going to speak with a dad who is also a bus driver, what he loves about this profession and his message to folks at home who may be considering it. But for now, live in New Britain, with the sight of school buses and a new school year ahead of us, I'm Keith McGilvery with the School Squad, Fox 61 News.